talk to strangers. It's dangerous. What up, guys? Mike Gross here at RockinGuitarLessons.com and YouTube.com slash RockinGuitarLessons1. That's D.O. with Don't Talk to Strangers. Vivian Campbell, the guitar player in the early days when Dio first started out on his solo career. Big influence on mine, man. Great player. He had his own kind of style going. Kind of a Gary Moore style, but he had his own style too. I put my Rocktron effects on kind of a sitar sound because uh, Vivian Campbell was using a 12-string uh, guitar for this. So um, the sitar kind of gives it a little more of a... Instead of just a straight sound, it almost mimics a 12-string. Kind of. I don't know. Sounds cool. So anyways, let's jump into this. It's not very tricky, but it's cool. Um, go first finger 1B, middle finger 2G. And here's the what the pick hand does. D, G, B. Again. And then D, B. So those are called eighth notes. 1, E, and a, 2, E, and a. to pick this too, I'll just throw it in, uh, is down, down, up, down, down, up, down, up. You don't have to, it's a good habit, okay? Now, do the same thing again, but get rid of your middle finger and go third finger, third fret G, leave your first finger where you got it. Pick it exactly the same way, guys. Go. So let's play it up to there. Then, leave your first finger, take your third finger, move it up to 3D. Okay, make sure your knuckle's positioned right. If it's angled down, it's going to be a problem. Angle it up, because we need the open G. We're going to go D, G, B, down, down, up with your pick hand. And then, go back to the second fret on the D. You could leave it down, because we're going back to it, you know. But, uh, middle finger, 2D, and then you got the open G and the first fret, B. Do the same strings, D, G, B. Then go right back to where you just came from. Third finger, 3D. Leave your first finger this whole time. And go D, B. And then you're back to the beginning chord, which was open D, second fret G, first fret B. That's the end of it. I want you to, I don't want to say you're back to the beginning there. You're not. He starts with the same chord that he finishes with, and then you start it all over again. So if you think about it, you're ending with this, and then you got to play it again, because the second time starts. All right, so hopefully you got that, you guys. Standard tuning, did I say that? If I didn't, I'm saying it now. Um, Dio, don't talk to strangers. Rest in peace, RJD, man. Best metal singer this world has ever known, man, in my opinion. Love Ronnie Dio. Smart man, too. So anyways, let's... Uh, well, we're done. We're wrapped up, aren't we? Uh, my name is Mike Gross. Watch my website, rockandguitarlessons.com, coming in June of 2012. That's this month. It just hasn't launched yet. Be ready for that. And uh, some cool things. You get a song a month by becoming a member there. Make sure to sign your email up once it's launched. You guys will know. It's coming soon enough. Be watching for it. Be patient. It's hard. The hardest thing for me is to be patient, but it's still being worked on. But we're doing the finishing touches on it as I speak. And uh, my YouTube channel is youtube.com slash rockandguitarlessons1. If you're not a current subscriber, go ahead and subscribe. I've been doing this 20 plus years privately, and I'm taking that element of private lessons and bringing it to you this way now. And uh, it's cool. You guys should dig it. And it, a lot of uh, freedom in the way that it's done as far as you guys calling the shots. Um, I'm t I'm, I, what I'm doing is applying the way I learned and bringing that to you guys. And after 20 years of teaching privately, I know it works, man, I really do. Um, you get Learning riffs is a great way to get going. And when you're ready for the next level, we'll take you from there. Peace, guys, talk to you soon. And remember, don't talk to strangers, it's not good. <laughs>